Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we're getting into hair removal. I have like the two most popular IPL at home hair removal devices with me today. We are going to compare them to see which ones are actually, which one is actually better. They are so different. They cost around the same, but they're like completely different. They're the, the way that they work, the results that you get is not the same at all. And I can't wait to spill the tea today with you guys. If you guys have been in the market and you guys have been looking to buy one, this is going to probably make your decision so much easier today. So back in July, if you guys are not new to my channel, I actually tried the You Like Out. I did like the full treatment onto underneath my armpits, onto my legs, and I did it into my bikini area and the results were actually amazing. I've never had my skin feel like that, like since back in high school, you know, back in high school when your like skin is so smooth and soft and it just feels really good. Um, and then you get older and you get like those like red little bumps everywhere, what are they called? They're called like strawberry legs or something like that. Well, this brought my skin back in time and I feel like my skin is just so soft now. So whenever I did that video, my friend actually asked me, what is the difference between Kenzie and the air um, the you like air 10 and I said well I actually don't know so that's what we're testing out today I want to see the difference because I've heard so many good things about this one I've heard so many good things about the you like as well and like obviously I've tested it out so I wanted to compare the both so badly and I'm so excited to do it today you like is sponsoring today's video so they gave me the chance to get my hands on this one and this one and compare them for you guys and I'm gonna give you guys my honest opinion on both devices Devices. So let's get into it. Let's get into actually what is IPL in the first place. So IPL just stands for intense pulse light, which is just like a fancy way of saying light pulses to target the melanin in our hair follicles. So which just means it stops the hair from growing back, meaning you have like very smooth skin, like within like two weeks. It doesn't take long for this thing to start working. You do have to use it like every other day. I think with you, like I had to use it like every three days for the first few weeks. And then it got rid of my hair slowly and like started targeting the hair, making it thinner and thinner and thinner to the point where it just didn't grow back. So it's very basic. That's just what IPL stands for. So comparing these compared to other of ways of getting rid of your hair, I used to shave all the time, which is why I got strawberry legs because whenever you shave over and over again, it starts to create thicker hair, right? And so I would have like my thick hair right at the top of my skin always peeking through and that's what makes that look of a strawberry leg and because you guys are using like let's say if you go in with an IPL device it's going to thin out the hair and thin it out thin it out and then you're not actually going to have hair underneath anymore so that's why it gets rid of those strawberry legs so if you've been looking for like those model looking smooth looking oh, just amazing <laughs> feeling legs that's how you get that with these and like whenever you lift up your armpits and you don't see like those dark spots anymore that's because it's getting rid of the hair completely and it just makes a huge difference on how your skin actually looks how it feels it almost feels like you are waxed but being waxed like i love the look of being waxed but i hate the feeling of somebody like actually pulling there's no way like i cannot do it and I hate the fact that I have to leave my house and then somebody's looking at my bikini area. Like I just cannot stand it. So this is like salon grade, like quality, <laughs> but in the comfort of your own home. My friend actually mentioned too, she's like, well, I think I'm just gonna go to a salon and get it done professionally, which I was like, yeah, cool. But honestly, my thought was like, okay, but I don't think you realize like how much, like how many times, how many sessions, how many treatments you actually have to do to get rid of this hair like with this th this thing right here i had to go in like every three days and i know it's actually the same whenever it comes to the salons like you have to go in so often and i'm talking like months and i think like oh my gosh i just I, it's so much money and these are like both under 350 dollars. so i just don't see why like i get the whole fact of like you might be scared if it's safe to use but it is it's completely safe to use and so anyway that's just my thoughts so yeah and i think another thing people don't even realize is that you actually have to shave every single time you use this i think that was like one of my biggest questions was do i have to shave every single time and you do because it's the only way to get like the light to go into the hair properly because if you have hair on the top it just like frizzles up the top of the hair and it doesn't go in as good so if you want 
to have really fast results. Make sure you are shaving every single time before going in with an eye peel device. Now let me show you guys what you actually get inside of the box and unbox them together because one of them has so much more than the other and like I said, they cost the same. So let's start off with the You Like Air 10. So this is priced around 319 US dollars. It's got a super clear instruction manual. It was very clear on the steps I was supposed to take. It showed me step by step on what I was supposed to do. And it also answered like every single question that I had, which was really nice. It also comes with foldable glasses for eye protection, which is so important because you have to be using eye protection whenever you're using these devices. Even if they say they're super safe for your eyes, don't like take the chance always put on the glasses, make sure that you are protected. And it also comes with a shaver. Like I said, you do have to shave every single time before using the device. So it's nice to know that you have this little shaver and you also get a cute little dust bag and the power cord, which we will get into later because the power cord, um, that's a huge difference whenever it comes to the two devices. That's actually the most important thing. Now let's get into the Kenzie IPL Multi Pro. This is priced at $349 right now US. So it is priced a little bit more. It's more expensive and it does come with some extras like attachments for skin rejuvenation and acne treatments, which is nice. And I also love the gold and white color. That's what drew me in. I love the device's color that they use, though it's like a bit chunky and and awkward to hold so whenever I would actually try and use the device it was harder to hold it didn't have like you guys can see whenever I'm holding them up it doesn't have this nice curve which is really easy to hold it's more like chunky and you have to kind of position your whole wrist. I don't know, it's hard to explain, but once you have it in your hands, you really do see the difference. With the instructions, this is the big difference. So it's just a basic card, which I was shocked by because I think something like an IPL at home hair removal device, you want every single answer that you have answered. It's super important, it's really serious. It's not just like a basic product that you're putting onto yourself. I was a little bit taken back by this. I was a little shocked, especially that this device is priced a little bit higher. I, l I was basically left not knowing how to use this. Like what was the difference between all the attachments? I was left in the unknown and I had to do so much research on YouTube to even know how to work this thing. Also inside of the package, there was no sunglasses. There was nothing to protect your eyes. There was no protection at all. It was just basically the machine and a card and the attachments. And so I feel like a lot of people are going to trust that they can use this machine without any type of glasses, which I think is just ridiculous. If you guys are gonna see like these bright flashing lights all the time, you have to have some type of protection on your eyes. Even if it is fine to use, I just wouldn't, I wouldn't do it. I don't know. Don't get me wrong. It's really, really nice and it looks pretty. It's really nice to look at and it has nice features like the whole skin rejuvenation and all that stuff. But it also came in with like import duties. Like I had to pay $50 for it to be delivered, which was not great. The you like device, I didn't have that problem. And so that's just something to know. I am from Canada. And so I did have to pay even more when it arrived. So this ended up being around $400 US. But of course, packaging and what's included is not everything. Let's talk about the performance and which one is actually better and which one gets rid of your hair faster and which one is going to have longer lasting results. So let's get into what you actually wanna know. So the You Like Air 10 actually has double the power compared to the Kenzie, meaning it's gonna get rid of your hair so much faster. It has 26, I believe, 26 joules of energy compared to Kenzie only having a max of 14, which just means that this is gonna get rid of your hair so much faster and it's just gonna be so much better, especially whenever it comes to the dual lights on the inside. So the U like has two dual lights. So every single time it flashes, it flashes twice in one go. This one only has one light. So like, I don't even have to explain any further which one's gonna do the best job, right? Like I feel like you guys already understand that it is gonna do a better job whenever it comes to how fast it's gonna get rid of your hair. 
yeah so anyway of course they have different settings and everything so the you like actually has four settings you can completely control how much power is actually being used onto your skin if you are nervous about that so it has the fast mode for quick touch-ups it has the normal mode for fine to normal hair so i like to use this onto my arms or my face it has the high mode and then it has shr mode at first whenever i started using this machine i'd only use like the normal mode because i was so scared that it would burn me or i would end up with those burn marks or like i was just so terrified and so i started off with the normal mode everywhere and then i advanced and got myself to the shr mode because you don't feel anything like that's what i realized afterwards was even on the shr mode which is like the strongest mode for stubborn hair i used it on to my underarms and my legs and my bikini area and there was no pain at all because it has a cooling technology it has like the sapphire cooling technology and so it's really cold to the touch this whole area into the front gets so cold that it feels like you're putting ice actually onto your arm so you do not feel a thing it's crazy and it doesn't like it never like stops getting cold it just stays cold the whole time that you are using it so you never like get burned you never feel pain and so I was able to use the um, SHR mode everywhere and that's when I started seeing a huge difference whenever I turned on that mode like my hair got so thin really quickly like within a few days the biggest difference like my hair just went super thin after using SHR mode so if you guys have been wondering like if it's going to hurt I can tell you right now that the U like doesn't but the Kenzie is hot because it doesn't have a cooling technology so whenever I use this I was shocked because I think I've been like so, how can I say, I've been spoiled with this one. So whenever I went in with the Genzi, I didn't know what to expect. I thought it was gonna be the same thing. I like put it onto my skin and I went to go use it and it was warm. Like it, does, it doesn't hurt, but it's like warm. And you're like, oh, okay. So I could feel it's doing something. And then like the more that you use it, the hotter the machine would get. I was not expecting that. I just like, I don't know why I think I was just so spoiled with you like, and I just figured like every single IPL device never got hot and was never warm and never like, I don't know. I just didn't know that. And so anyway, with the Kenzie, just like you know, you are not gonna get that cooling um, technology. You are not gonna have like, um, like a complete painless, like treatment you are going to feel warmness and it's going to get hotter and hotter as you use it and if you guys are worried about your skin the you like actually comes with a safety so it has a skin sensor that detects your skin tone and adjusts the treatment power automatically it won't even start if it doesn't like it doesn't feel like it's a safe area it's not going to start it's not going to flash so you can relax and just trust that everything's completely safe whenever you use it this does not have a skin sensor at least i don't see it i don't think it does i haven't seen a skin sensor so if somebody was to ask me which one would i get after learning everything that i did because i had no clue that this was even like all these little things i had no clue about until i got both into my hands so now that i have both in my hands i would highly suggest the you like over the kenzie any day they're the cooling technology you're not going to feel any type of pain it has the skin sensor it's going to keep you safe at all times and i just like everything about it is just way better to, in my opinion and so if you guys want the you like i will leave a link in the description box down below so you guys can go check it out i'll use i'll put my coupon code too from my last collaboration i had a coupon code so i'll put it there too i'm not sure how much of a discount that you get but in case you want a little bit more money off you can use my coupon code anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video and all thoughts were my own and i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys in the next